my Mila's Math channel. In this video, we're going to teach you on how to solve adding and subtracting the similar fractions with tricks. Don't skip this video. That's why you can follow this step by step so that you understand everything. It will help you to easy to solve the fractions. So don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and click the notification bell. Everyone, are you ready? So let's start. Number one, we have two third plus one half. Okay, so this is the denominator, the numerator. So first step is multiply the denominator. Okay, so three times two equals six. Next, cross multiply. Ito. 2 times 2 equals 4 plus 3 times 1 equals 3. So the answer is 4 plus 3 equals 7 over copy natin si 6. 7 over 6 that is improper fraction. Therefore, change into mixed number. 1 and 1, 6. Okay, so 1 and 1, 6 because 7 divides 6. The answer is 1. And then may remainder in a 1. So therefore, yung remainder ilalagay natin as in numerator. So yung 1, that is the answer. So 6 times 1 equals 6 plus 1 is 7. So 7 over 6. Okay, next, number 2. 4 fifth plus 3 fourths. Again, multiply yung denominator. 5 times 4 equals 20. Next, cross multiply. 4 times 4 equals 16. Then, 3 times 5 equals 15. So, 16 plus 15, the answer is 31 over 20. So, 31 over 20, that is improper fraction. Change into mixed number. 31 divided 20, the answer is 1. Copy the denominator, which is 20. And then, yung remainder niyan is 11. Okay, so let's check. 20 times 1 equals 20, plus 11 equals 31 over 20. Okay, next, number 3. Try nyo sagutan ito, number 3. Six over seven plus two thirds. Ayan, i-post nyo muna yung video and then sagutan nyo ito. Pagkatapos yung sagutan, i-continue nyo lang, okay? So, and let's start. 7 times 3, ita times lagi natin yung denominator. As a denominator, okay? So, 7 times 3 equals 21. 21, yung sagot nito. And then, cross multiply. 6 times 3 equals 18. Okay, so next... Dito naman, 7 times 2 equals 14. Okay, so 18 plus 14, what is the answer? The answer is 32 over 21. 32 over 21, that is improper fraction. So therefore, change into mixed number. How to change? I-divide lang po natin. 32 divide 21, the answer is 1 and then, yung remainder niyan is 11. Okay, so 21 times 1 equals 21 plus 11, that is 32. Okay? So, parehas ba tayo ng sagot? Kung parehas tayo ng sagot, ibig sabihin, natutunan mo yung tinuro ko na tricks. Next. Okay, now let's move on on how to solve subtracting the similar fractions. Okay, so we have 5 fourth minus 2 thirds. 
Okay, ngayon, ituturo ko sa inyo kung paano ba ito isusolve para mapabilis or matandaan nyo kung ano ba yun. Okay? So, first step is cross-multiply natin. Okay? So, ito, 5 third, hindi multiply natin yan. Okay? So, 5 times 3 equals 15. Right? Next, 2 times 4. Okay? So, 2 times 4. What is the answer? The answer is 8. Okay? Next, what is the operation? The operation is minus. So, lagyan natin ng minus sa gitna. Then, i-multiply natin ito. 4 times 3. What is the answer? 12. Okay? So, hatiin natin ito. Laging dandaan. Anong nag-form ba siya ng ano? Anong kung sa tingin nyo? Ayan. Nag-form siya ng butterfly. So, 15 minus 8. Ano ang sagot? The answer is 7. Then, 12. Ayan. Okay? So, mabilis yung matandaan kasi nag-form siya ng butterfly. The first step is cross-multiply yun. Hindi ba? Multiply natin si 5 times 3 equals 15. Next, 2 times 4 equals 8. So, 15 minus 8, the answer is 7. And then, 4 times 3, the answer is 12. Di ba mabilis lang siya? Unlike ito, nagigay ako sa inyo, same given. 5 over 4 minus 2 thirds. Pili kayo kung alin ba ang mas madaling tandaan. Okay? So, since the similar fraction, what will you do? The first is find the LCD or less common denominator. Okay? Or less common multiple. So, 4 and 3, what is the LCD? That is 12. Okay? Kasi, bakit 12? Ganito yan. 4 and 3, hanapin mo daw yung common. 4, 8, 12. Skip counting by 4. Okay? Then, 16. Next, 3, 6, 9, 12. Ayan. May common na ba sila? Si 4 meron ba dito? Wala. 8. Meron ba? si 12 meron. Ibig sabihin, yung LCD nila or LCM is 12. Kaya 12 yung denominator natin. So, tingnan nyo maigi kung, alin, kung saan ba kayo na, nadadalian. Okay? Next, 12 divided 4, the answer is 3 times 5 equals 15. Minus, 12 divided 3 equals 4 times 2 equals 8. 15 minus 8, the answer is 7. Then, copy the denominator. So, di ba parehas yung sagot? Ibig sabihin, tama ito, tama alin ito. Kasi same sila ng answer. Nasa iyo na yan, kung ano ang gusto mo or kung alin dyan ang susundin mo na kung alin dyan yung susundin mo sa pag-solve or saan kang nadadalian. Okay, next. Magbigay ulit ako na next given para hindi nyo talaga siya makakalimutan. Okay. Yeah, 6 over 5 minus 2, 6. Ayan. Okay. Sundin natin yung una kong tinuro. Yung butterfly. Okay. So, 6 times 6. Ito yan, o. Oh. 6 times 6 equals 36. Lagyan natin dyan. Pagano yun eh. Diba? Next. Multiply. 2 times 5. Ano ang sagot? 10. Ano ang operation? Minus. Ayan. Next, multiply natin to. 6 times 5 plus 30. Now, 36. Bawasan mo ng 10. Ito yan, no? 36 minus 10. Copy natin yung 30. Okay, so 36 minus 10, the answer is 26 over 30. 26 over 30, may divisible ba na number na pwede mong may divide dyan? Yes, kasi si 26, that is even number and 30. So therefore, divisible by 2. So 26 over 30 
If you divide natin both by 2. So, 26 divided by 2, the answer is 13. 30 divided by 2, the answer is 15. So, the correct answer is 13 over 15. Ayan. Kukuha. So, itry yung sagutan yung pangalawa na tinuro ko sa inyo kung saan ba kayo na talian. Okay? So, try natin sagutan next kung parehas ba. 13 over 15. Check natin kung parehas. 6 over 5 minus 2 over 6. Di ba? Pag dissimilar, lagi hindi mo siya pwede isasubtract. Ang gagawin natin, hanapin natin yung pinaka last common multiple or or less common denominator. So, how to find 5 and 6? Skip counting by 5. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Next, 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36. May nakita na ba kayong common nila? Yung pinaka last common? Si 5, meron ba? 10, meron ba? 15, wala. 20, wala. 25, wala. Therefore, 30, meron. So, therefore, our LCD is 30. So, 30 divide 5. The answer is 6 times 6 times natin 36. Minus 30 divide 6, 5 times 2 equals 10. 36 minus 10, the answer is 26 over 30. So, 26 over 30, divide both by 2. Kasi, pariya sila ito number. Okay, so, 26 divide 2, the answer is 13. 30 divide 2 is 15. So, parehas ba yung sagot? Yung kanina at ngayon? So, since parehas, ibig sabihin, applicable yung butterfly na tinuro ko. Okay, next. Ito, try yung sagotan. Tingnan natin kung nakuha nyo yung tinuro ko. Gusto ko yung pagsagot nyo ay yung butterfly yung ano. Okay? So, 8 over 5 minus 1 third. Ayan. Try yung sagotan. Okay? I-post nyo muna itong video na to bago nyo i-continue. Okay? Maliwana po ba? Okay. So, sasagutan ko na siya. Yung, ang, ang gamitin ko, yung butterfly. Okay? So, first is cross multiply. 8 times 3 equals 24. Next, 1 times 5 equals 5. Next, multiply. 5 times equals 15. Ano ang operation natin? Para hindi tayo makalim makalimutan. Lagyan natin ganun kasi yung, yung operation natin is minus. ba? So, copy natin dyan. So, 24 minus 5. The answer is 19. I-copy natin si 15. Ayan. 19 over 15, that is improper fraction. So, therefore, change into mixed number. How to change? Divide. Okay, 19 divide 15, the answer is 1. Copy the denominator, which is 15. Then, yung numerator niya is 4. Bakit 4? Kasi 4 yung remainder. Okay, so let's check. 15 times 1 equals 15 plus 4 equals 19 over 15. Okay, so... Parehas ba tayo ng sagot? 1 and, over, 1 and 4 over 15. Okay, so that's it. Thank you for watching. Sana may natutunan kayo.